Hey there, welcome to my channel. In this video, let's learn about resistors, types of resistors and resistor coding. So let's get started. Resistor is one of the three main basic components of electrical electronics. It is a device which offers resistance to passage of current and its basic construction is a resistive element on a ceramic base or core. It is denoted by R and it is measured in ohms, which is denoted by symbol like this. The symbol of resistor is this. This is a general symbol, but it has many other symbols which differ based on its type. Before diving into types of resistors, Let's have a look at its properties. Power rating tells us the operating voltage, current and power dissipation. Frequency is actually the operating frequency. Tolerance is defined as the error in resistance value measured in percentage. TCR means temperature coefficient of resistance. It is measured in ppm per kelvin or ppm per degree centigrade. It represents the change in resistance due to change in temperature. Now let's look at the types of resistors. Here is the classification. Resistors are basically two types. Special or non-linear resistors and linear resistors. Non-linear resistors are also called special resistors because they could be used as sensors. Resistor based sensors. While linear resistors are divided into fixed and variable. Fixed Resistors are divided into five, which are SMD, foil, wire wound, carbon composite, and film. So the wire wound resistors are divided into two types, power and precision. So the film resistors are again divided into two types, thick and thin. These two are film resistors types. In thick film resistors, there are three types. Fusible, cement, and metal oxide. Similarly, in thin film resistors, there are three types: carbon, metal, metal glaze. Metal glaze. So, on the other hand, the variable resistor is classified into three, which are rheostat, potentiometer, and tremor. Let's have a look at the properties of each type of resistor. Let's begin with fixed resistors. These two are types of wire wound resistor. Their construction is same. It is a wire wound on ceramic base. Here, wire acts as a resistive element. But it, if it is observed, it also acts as an inductor and also has stake capacitance. So, these type of resistors are generally preferred for low frequency of operation. Power wire wound resistor is generally used for high power applications. So, it is used generally in power stations and high power applications. It has very high tolerance, but it will depend on temperature. And its TCR is reliable, slightly reliable, about 75 ppm per Kelvin. So, next one is precision wire wound. As its name indicates, its tolerance is very high and it is 0.1 percent more than any other resistor. Now these types, this is the most tolerant resistor and 0.1 percent more tolerant. And also its TCR is very high, sorry, very low, which makes it highly reliable. And these precision wire wound resistors are used in low voltage applications and instrumentation. Next. Let's talk about CCR, Carbon Composite Resistor. It is a mixture of carbon and clay on a ceramic base. It is used in high power applications, but it is not commonly used. It is not commonly preferred, though its power rating is very high because it is less tolerant to high current and TCR is not reliable and its frequency stability is less. 
So these type of resistors are generally used for welding circuitry, high and in high power circuits for the purpose of protection from fluctuations. So we can also say spike protection. for high power circuits like in welding circuitry now let's look at thick pin resistor cement resistor it is constructed by a material called cement it is a combination of ceramic and metal its main drawback is its high TCR value it is highly tolerant and could be operated till few megahertz of frequency so its power rating is high which is the reason it is used generally in power stations, high power applications and current limiters. Next one is fusible resistor. As its name indicates, it is a combination of fuse and a resistor. So in normal case it acts as a resistor and when there is no overload or any fluctuation, it acts as a fuse. It is very robust with respect to temperature, with respect to TCR, with high tolerance and the frequency is same till few megahertz and its power rating is low because it is generally used for PCBs. Yes, this is a fuse, it is used for circuit production. So, next comes metal oxide resistor, its construction is like this in a metal oxide resistor element on a ceramic base its symbol looks just like the ordinary resistor general, general symbol but like the previous resistor its main drawback is it is its TCR 200 ppm per kelvin similar to cement resistor and this is very rarely used and less preferred because it has less frequency stability, low power rating, but its tolerance value is very high on the other hand. So it is used in current limiters, spike protection, fuses. Now let's look at thin film resistors, which are carbon, metal, and metal glaze. So coming to carbon resistor. It is the most widely used resistor with good frequency stability, high voltage, low power rating, high tolerance. But its TCR is, is its main drawback. It sometimes exhibits negative TCR, which means the resistance will decrease with increasing temperature. So it is used widely in general purpose circuit lasers and radars. Next one is metal resistor which is similar to carbon resistor but higher tolerance with similar properties like low power same good frequency stability L3 megahertz and a bit reliable TCR value but it depends on temperature so it is generally used in filters and breathing circuits Next comes metal glaze resistor. So it is similar to the previous two, but it has high power rating, high tolerance, and highly reliable TCR 2 ppm per Kelvin, which makes it more accurate. And it is one of the most accurate resistors. Up and here is frequency stability is good so it is used for high access applications like in aviation, in missiles, in satellites etc and next comes foil resistor whose construction is a resistive foil on a ceramic base which is more accurate than metal glaze and more tolerant and also more tolerant more tolerant than 
metal glaze and even more reliable in PCR. So it is the one of the most accurate resistors in all types. This frequency stability is not and power rating is high. So same like metal glaze is used for high accuracy applications like satellites, aviation, missiles. But this one is more robust than metal glaze. Its construction is more robust than metal glaze. So they are also used in oil rigs, volcanoes, etc. So those are the places which have very high TCR value and where these are not used. This can't be used. And the next is assembly resistor which we you know yes surface mount resistor it is also represented as SMT or SMD which means sur surface mount resistor so it is small in size and widely used in PCBs so if you observe this voltage setting is low and frequency is stable till few gigahertz which is very high stable highly stable and also it's got high tolerance and a reliable TCR value for PCBs is this TCR value is very reliable so next let's look at the variable resistors yesterday potential meter and trimmer this is the symbol of free stat so it is a variable wire bond resistor which means its properties will be similar to a wire bond resistor so its frequency of operation is low and power rating is up to 50 watts and its tolerance decreases with temperature similar to wire bond resistors and it has a slightly reliable TCR value and used in hyper applications Its power rating is in orders of 50 watts, but it's used in high power applications generally as a voltage divider. Next one is potentiometer. This is the symbol of potentiometer. This is the symbol of PSTR, and this is the symbol of potentiometer. Here the two, two leads are short. Here these are not, these are not short. So it is a variable resistor with low power rating, but it can withstand very high voltages. It has high tolerance. Unlike this, this is not. Unlike this one, this is not dependent on temperature, but its TCR value will depend on temperature, though it is reliable. It is used by doing control arms and dimmers. So this two acts as a voltage divider. But this is similar to a film. This is similar to a film resistor construction. But this is a wire bond resistor. And next, I'll say tremor resistor. So it is the symbol of tremor resistor. Which could be more accurately described as miniature potentiometers. So they are mainly used in PCBs, which, which serve the same purpose of a potentiometer, just as a variable resistor and a voltage divider. So its power rating is low, it has good frequency stability in this very high tolerant than this because it is usually PCBs and this here is same so that's all for this video if you felt you learned something new then please like and share the video with your friends for more such content subscribe my channel and please leave a comment below part 2 video will be released on next Wednesday 
Till then, stay safe. And to make anything possible, hand the plausible.